you guys welcome back you may look at my background and see it looks a little different in my office because we moved the computer downstairs so i originally wasn't going to do a room for baby boy even though we have an extra room just because i felt like we're moving soon but i haven't been able we haven't been able to find a house that we're like dead set on so i think i'm going to do like a half room have a dresser and things like that in his room and his clothes but full on everything i'm not quite sure because like i said we may be moving hopefully within the next like six to nine months we'll see anyways i thought i would take you guys along with me as i sort through all of his clothes and organize it and put them away um, I got a lot of clothes at our shower, which was so sweet for my sister-in-law, Kulia, to throw us. Um, and then the sweetest thing ever, too, my sister-in-law, sister, Candace and Matt, they gave us all their boy clothes, which are darling. But anyways, you guys, this is my current situation right now. Separating all his clothes, diapers, blanket. So I guess I'll show you guys a little bit of his clothes that we got. By the way, if you hear Luna playing in the background, she's been obsessed with playing with my makeup. Huh, Lulu, Luna, Lulu, Luna. <laughs> so she sits there and she'll sit there for a half an hour and do her makeup. <laughs> do your makeup do your makeup crazy thing is too it's september and it was like 50 degrees this morning and all day it's been rainy and overcast and so hence kiloni's football hoodie because it's like the only thing that fits me but anyways i don't have a lot of newborn things just because i feel like they grow out of newborns really quickly but my sweet mom she got me these cute little pajamas this is like a must-have for me there's nothing underneath except the little scrunchie when they're newborns because you're just you don't you don't got time for that changing them in the middle of the night um cutest there's actually some things that i probably don't want to show you guys yet because i want to do a video of baby must-haves and so there's some things i'm going to show in there so candace who gave me all the stuff some of them have tags on it and they're all from like gap and zara and they're so cute like look at this little quilt i'm dying and the funny thing is <laughs> sticking her tongue at me the funny thing is is i was like i'm not looking forward to boy clothes because they're so ugly um but i'm shocked of how cute a lot of these boy clothes are shocked of how cute I'm so glad she's laughing right now because she got some shots and she has been really sore. That's just a few items I got. I won't go through everything, but I am going to wash all these in some uh, baby detergent and then I'm going to fold them and put them into some organizers I got from Ikea. So I just got these little organizers to go in his drawers. Oh, I'm confused how this goes. What in the world? What is happening here? How does this go? Luna buggy. Did you oh did you just dump mommy's bobby pins everywhere? Luna buggy. Forget about it. Luna. <laughs> Anyways, I should probably clean that up. Okay, well, let's go wash these and then fold them and start organizing them into those bins.
Okay, so it's the next day. I finally got all of his clothes washed. It's like a bomb has gone in here. I'm gonna now organize all of this and get them folded into bins. I think what I'm gonna do. So I have these bins I got from Ikea and I'm gonna start putting um, like socks in one and then burp cloths in the other and then zero to three month. I'm already separating, already separating all his zero to three month clothing right here so this will be left out and then everything else I will put in storage but let's get folded of you in LA All right, you guys, I'm stressing out a little bit because <sighs> Kiloni only has three days off in the whole month of September. Well, the rest of September and baby comes in October and I am having the feeling sometime in the beginning, mid October. Um, so this is baby boy's current room situation right now. And this is like a huge step up from what it did look like um we had all those clothes that you guys saw that i folded and then we're just trying to get this together and it's giving me anxiety because i don't like clutter i don't like stuff i don't like things it's hard because he's not here a lot and i you know I'm giving birth in like like a month or less so it's hard because I hate being like dependent on him and so he is at the park right now with Luna giving her a break outside of running errands we've been running errands all day since he just got home from the station and I think I'm going to try to tackle putting the dresser together I don't know if you guys feel the same way I just don't like feeling dependent on somebody so I can do this right Hopefully, let's see. Let's try. <laughs> Slowly but surely. <laughs> also, you guys, I am going totally different with his room. I'm for the next house, or if we decide we're going to stay in this house for a while, I'll paint. These are some inspiration picks that I'm having. So I got this like walnut dresser. That is my hospital bag, by the way. Want to get a different boppy cover right here. So if you guys have any cute boppy Etsy boppy shops so that I can get some, let me know. I guess I may need some tools. I guess I may need a screwdriver or something to put this together. Oh, I hate Ikea furniture. Thanks, babe. Oh, three flights of stairs, not fun. Oh, are you coming? <laughs> are you coming? Oh. I need some stuff. What you need? I need... Hi! <laughs> I legit thought you were gonna be mad when you walked in. But what? That I started doing this. Whatever. I thought you were gonna be mad. Luna! Are you looking at you? Oh, you give kisses? <laughs> Finally, we got it done. This is the problem though. This is his newborn clothes and they don't fit in these type of drawers. 
but we got his swaddles. I need to finish washing those. Burp cloths and socks. Don't care if these were used for Luna or not. They have spit up on it. Let's see. That is zero to three months pajamas and then zero to three months tops and bottoms. Okay, I have this other IKEA basket and I think I will just put it in there and put his PJs in there. I just hate how much space is being wasted right there. Maybe I'll put his onesies. Okay, PJs, onesies, or tops. Perfect. And then this is for when we start changing him in here, and these are one diapers. We have this right here, which is newborns, and then Burt Kloss pads for me for um, breastfeeding and wipes. So that is what we will take in our room. We'll be changing him in our room for the most part or wherever we're at rather than in here. Next, we have zero to three month clothes. So once he's out of newborn, I'll just transfer this up. And we have his pajamas and his uh, shorts and or his pants and his onesies and sleep sacks that will fit him. Then this is a... Doesn't look organized, but I swear it is, you guys. But this is all three to nine, and this is all six to 12 clothes. So we have that put away. Then here's his blankets that got washed, and they will be in there. We have all of his pacifiers and binkies, and then all the nipples for bottles. Um, and then next is all of the feeding. So I plan on breastfeeding again like I did with Luna. So I have my breast pump, a manual pump for when we travel or if I'm out and about. I have formula. This I love. Honestly, you guys, I was so naive as a first time parent and I was not, I was determined to never give a drop of formula to Luna, but we went to Hawaii when she was like six, seven months old. And we gave her formula because I was not getting enough milk out of here and it was a lifesaver and it helped me out and Kiloni loved feeding her so this will be like supplement as like if we're going out and I don't have milk or if we're traveling I will bring that to make sure she's getting fed um all of her his, oh my gosh I almost said her all of his bottles and then cleaning rack we got him a little hydro flask if we need to put like more milk in there um, and then we got some pads. So that is everything, you guys. All right, you guys, that is the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe, and we will see you guys next time. Of you in LA.